Meghan Markle and Harry could wait to start a family until after this important event. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry could wait to start a family until after a very important event on their royal calendar, a leading expert on the family has exclusively told Express Co. UK. James Brooks said the smitten royal couple could wait until their autumn tour is over after embarking in August before they seriously think about having children. He commented, Although Harry has made it known that he'd like to settle down and start a family, I think the couple will wait until the tour is over before they seriously think about having children. Both of them, particularly Harry, will be well aware of the royal responsibilities they have in their new roles and now the tour has been confirmed and is being planned, they will want to ensure it goes ahead. They'll no doubt be looking forward to it. The Duke and Duchess Autumn Tour will take the couple to Australia, New Zealand, Fiji and Tonga. However, both Tonga and Fiji are currently plagued by the Zika virus. Mr. Brooks noted health officials have advised those who visit the countries should wait at least six months before trying to conceive. This means if the Duke and Duchess of Sussex follow through with the entirety of their visit, they could have to wait until almost a year into their marriage before attempting to start a family. However the royal expert insisted such a timetable would be realistic for the couple who would have settled into their roles by that point. Mr. Brooks went on, in terms of the Fiji and Tonga situation, that will be a wait-and-see scenario. The palace will be closely monitoring the situation and, should any outbreaks or epidemics develop, then it could be a case of cutting the visit short. While reasonable protections can be taken though. I can't see the couple cancelling that part of the tour. Where it could cause a few issues is with any planned pregnancy. Health authorities suggest couples wait at least six months after getting back from the areas before trying to conceive. But this seems like a realistic timescale for the couple. By that time, they'll have been married for almost a year, will have settled into their royal roles as a pair, and can begin to start thinking about a family. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention CDC has insisted Zika has been reported in Tonga. It added the only real danger was to those who are pregnant. The CDC stated, Zika virus has been reported in Tonga. Public health officials have reported that mosquitoes in Tonga are infected with Zika and spreading it to people. Many people infected with Zika virus do not get sick or only have mild symptoms. However, infection during pregnancy can cause severe birth defects. Because there is no vaccine or medicine for Zika, travelers should take steps to prevent getting Zika during travel. They should also take steps to prevent spreading it when they return home. Meanwhile, the International Association for Medical Assistance for Travelers declared Fiji has presented evidence of ongoing Zika virus transmission. It said, there is evidence of ongoing Zika virus transmission in Fiji. Take meticulous anti-mosquito bite measures during the daytime. Pregnant travelers should postpone travel to this country.